Not all of us native men are wolf pack material. That's all I'm saying. You know, if you don't know who the wolf pack is, right? This group of native men, they're just ripped muscle, zero percent body fat, you know? And I'm like, hey, Hollywood, not all of us native men are wolf pack material. Some of us are backpacks, okay? That's all I'm saying. They could have been fair, right? They could have cast one chubby Wolfpack member. I could have went out for that role. I'll be that one that shows up about five seconds later. Like, <laughs> Guys, wait up, wait up. Ah, time out, time out, time out. <sighs> Jacob, Jacob, wait for me, wait for me, wait for me. Call Dr. Cullen. Call Dr. Cullen. <laughs> Think I'm having cardiac arrest? <sighs> maybe, maybe I didn't even change into a wolf. Maybe I changed into a res dog. I got fleas, maybe, you know? Maybe I got no tail. Where's my tail? What? <laughs> got bullet wounds, you know? Because if you've ever seen a res dog, we should be all be more like res dogs. Res dogs are survivors, man. I've seen them with bullet wounds. They're combat veterans, that's what they are. They know how to survive, man. You know, they're tough. I've seen a res dog get run over twice right in front of me. And it was one of those things where you, you can't look away, right? It just happened so quick. Poof, I was like, oh, I went to slow motion. It was like a movie. I was like, puppy. Puppy was like, Ernie. He's getting run over. <laughs> There's some jobs in the world I just would not like to have. One of them is those uh, Hollywood movie characters. They're out on the street, you know. Some of these guys, they look pretty sketchy to me, you know. Like Superman was out there. He's all greasy, slimy hair, man. He looks like a sex offender, you know, just kind of standing around. You know? How about a picture with a man of feel? I mean, steel. Spider-Man, his suit was all baggy, you know, it looked like malnutrition, you know. <laughs> Tried to do his thing, you know, puff of smoke just came out of it. <laughs> I'm hungry, feed me, please. <laughs> they, even, they even had uh, Chewie from, uh, from Chewbacca from Star Wars. But it was like a short one, man. Chewbacca's about eight feet tall. This was like a pygmy squatch guy. <laughs> Look like a short Bigfoot, you know, mini, mini foot standing there. I felt sorry for those guys, man. And then even here in Phoenix, there's these guys, sign holders, man. I would hate that job. Some of these guys look like they need medical attention, man. You know, they're sitting there. They're about to go down. And there's uh, Indians that are born in the city. They're urban Indians. Right? Yeah. Some of us, though, are urban challenged. In other words, we're rezzed, all right? Now, you'll know if you're uh, urban challenged, okay? If, uh, if, if, if you're immune to lotion, you're probably urban challenged, okay? Some of us, lotion doesn't even work on us. It's just some stage dry. If you think IHOP stands for Indian Housing Opportunity Program, you're rezzed. If you think Olive Garden is a place of worship. <laughs> you going to Olive Garden? Let me go with you, man. I gotta confess some sins. If you think Fox 10 is a strip joint, you are res. Hey guys, thank you very much, man. I'm Ernie Sosa, the third. Love you guys.